Hello guys, welcome back to Design and Tech of YouTube channel and welcome to another episode of an amazing video. In this video, I'm going to be creating an eye-catching by the flyer with my smartphone using the Pixel app app. But before we dive into the video, if you are new to my YouTube channel, please click on the subscribe button and put on the notification bell to get notified whenever I upload new and amazing content. And as for the returning viewers, thank you, I really appreciate it. So the first thing in creating the by the body flyer is to import the background. To import the background, you use at the third icon here by clicking on that. Once you import your background using that icon, then you click on use image from gallery. After importing your background, you still have the, the image quality, you have it retained compared to using this plus icon and clicking on from gallery. So you click on these three dots, then click on use image from gallery browse for the background if it is not available there so you can just get your background here so as you can see this is the background so after importing the background like this the next thing is to get the next thing is to get to bring in the celebrant image so you click on this plus icon then you click on from gallery so you bring in the celebrant image increase the image after increasing the image like this just copy the image copy the image then you delete the old image we are doing this by so that the quality of this image can be retained once you bring in an image from a gallery and you change the size you make you make a change on the size of the image just copy it and uh, you delete the old one so that you can have a good quality for the image so after that the next thing we are going to be doing is to blend in the image into the background so how do you blend in the image into the background go to shape once you go to shape like this create your shape so you move to gradient you select gradient like this then you select this white and black uh, color click on the plus icon click on this this you click on this so click on it then you click on this color icon you click on the color icon here then you can select any color you want for that so the color the color for that you click on the second one here you click on this then you click on this color icon then you slide this down this would be colorless there will be no color here so you slide this you bring this in so we've created a fading gradient like this so after creating this fading gradient the next thing is to move to texture click on texture then you click on this gallery icon then you're going to texture that we are going to texture it with the background so you click on the background then cut out the part of the background you want to use so like this if this is not where you can see here you can see the, back, the background is nowhere so just enable this you can see that then bring this down so you can see how i've just i uh, bring in how i've just blend in the image into the background so after that i'm going to bring in another image for the celebrant which is this then i'll be placing this i'll be placing it i'll be placing it here so placing that here you can see to make the image look realistic like the image is standing on the surface we are going to create a shadow so click on shape increase the radius to form a circle shape reduce the opacity you move down to stroke increase the stroke then you reduce the image you reduce the image you make sure there is no circle between the image then you move down to blur yeah you blur the image then you bring it down here move to 3d rotate to rotate this and then place it here it will be underneath the image underneath the image like this so you can just you can reduce the opacity for the shadow move on to opacity then reduce it a little bit so you can see to make things we look realistic that is why we create that a fading shadow so after that the next thing we are going to do is to create some shapes so we are going to be placing this here copy this 
place it here copy this then place it here so the first one will be in yellow color the second one will be in red color like this so just like this so after that after changing the color for the shape we are going to be creating some test so we move on to test happy we create this test move on to font to change the font then we are going to be using my stand both for the font then bring it onto this shape you bring it onto this shape on the it will be placed on the yellow shape reduce the size a little bit then we increase we'll give it a little spacing copy this we copy the happy since we are creating another test using the same font and the same size so you copy this and then edit it glorious so we are going to be placing this on top of the red shape the spacing you change the spacing then replace this on the red on the red shape copy this then edit it as well back the So this is going to be in black color. So just like this. So just like this. So the next thing is to create another test. Font. So you are going to change the font for this. The font is Amavi Coast. It is not Pixel App font. You have to download it from the font site, then install install it into the Pixel App app. So we change the font for this. Move to blue style make the font make the make it good then increase the size for this we are going to be making this in a slanting format place it here then, then bring it onto this image we are going to be reducing the opacity just like that so like this so we are going to copy this let's change back it opacity to 100 then increase the size then this will be here this will be at the back so we take it to the back to back then reduce its opacity let's lock it to the screen interface lock everything to the screen interface to avoid so just like this so the next thing is to create another test Then change the font. 
we are going we are going to be using a mavic coast for this as well make it bold then bring it then Push the size for the name a little bit so we can just place that there. To padding, so like this. So after that, we move on to test, click on test. Then this will be O, capital O. Then you move to font. You select, you use Amavi Coast font. Increase the size. Copy it, take it out of the screen. Then we are going to merge the two together. After merging it together, move on to eraser. We move on to eraser. We want to erase. Increase the eraser. So just like this so you can just place it there just like that so the next thing is to create the the by day date so that will be 23rd February 2024 then change the font change the font to monster boot and change the alignment to the center alignment then we reduce the reduce the text and bring it in between the circle here just like this so you place it in between this circle so the next thing we are going to create another test which is live long and prosper then move to font this will be amavi coast as well this l will be in small letter Then you bring it here. We reduce the spacing, the line spacing. We reduce the line spacing. Then to pattern, increase the pattern like this so that the letter will be showing where. Then we are going to be placing this here. Reduce the opacity a little bit. So after that, you can just put your brand name on the top like this. Over Thursday, you can put anything. The creative designer. Then I'll be changing the font for this. The font will be Monster and Semi Boot. Reduce the size. And then increase our increase the spacing. Then place it at the center like this. 
so after we are done creating the bride flyer like this the next thing is to save the image we are going to save it you click on the save icon yes save as image then you click on this change it to png then you change it to ultra so that you can have an high standard resolution design after you are done saving the design like that then move on to you move on to snapseed the snapseed app for enhancement we are going to be enhancing the design the by the flyer we are going to be enhancing it with the snapseed app so once you go to the snapseed app this is the interface of the snapseed app as written on it you can see tap anywhere to open a photo so you click on this you tap on the screen then you select your design after selecting your design after you bring in the design you can just click on tools click on tools here click on details then increase the detail and then you click on this you click on this or you hold the screen then you slide up then you increase the sharpening after that you click on tools again click on tune image the first on the list click on tune image then slide up click hold on the screen slide up to increase the saturation slide up again to increase the ambience the ambience slide up again to increase the highlight you can see the comparison between our old design and the new design this is the old this is the new so let's give it a little structure let's increase the structure a little bit so you can see the difference after enhancing the design with our snapseed app just click on export here then export then the design has been exported now so that is just how to create this beautiful and amazing body flyer please if you find this video helpful please don't forget to like comment and subscribe on the youtube channel thanks for watching